That verbal tussle between President Duterte and leftist leader Joma Sison is not yet over. Sison says it's good news that Duterte is not in a coma. Meanwhile, Senator Trillanes also welcomes the news that the president is very much alive. But the two critics are not sending Duterte their warm regards. Here's Maricel Halili with a report. Communist Party founder Jose Maria Sison says he's pleased that President Rodrigo Duterte isn't in a coma, but he isn't wishing the president well. Sison says Duterte has a chance of living long enough to be tried by the People's Court or the International Criminal Court. Sison earlier posted on his Facebook page that he received reports saying that the president was comatose, but he clarified that these were unverified. Despite special assistant to the President Bongo's video disproving rumors that the President is in coma, the leftist leader isn't convinced that Duterte is A-OK. He noted that the Commander-in-Chief looks exhausted and his right eye was drooping as if he just came from a dialysis. In defense of his father, Davao City Mayor Sara Duterte doubts if it is indeed season that's posting on his Facebook page. She thinks it must be his caretaker that's doing the job. She further claims that the poster is unraveling and will soon say that the president is an alien. Former President Noynoy Aquino, on the other hand, sympathizes with Duterte. He admits that work in Malacanang is really taxing. Parang mahirap naman yata ang every time na lang na may magre-raise ng isyong ganun, sasagutin. Baka wala ka nang ginawa eh, kung di sagot na sagot. Senator Antonio Trillanes, one of the president's most vocal critics, echoes Sison's sentiments. He took a swipe at the president once more. Ako naniniwala na si Duterte masamang damo, so matagal mamamatayan. More than yung physical health niya, yung mental health ang kailangan natin usisain. Sa akin, kung mamamatay siya, then uh, di umatenda lang tayo ng burol. For News 5, Maricel Halili, we are One News.